Much of the credit for Purdue's win at Illinois on Tuesday night is being given to the timely threes that the Boilermakers hit in the second half. Braden Smith's dagger was big, and Illinois certainly struggled locating shooters in transition. They doubled Zach Eady three times in the post in the second half. All three led to open threes, and all three threes went down. But the reason Purdue was able to come back from 10 points down on the road and win had everything to do with Zach Eady's impact on the defensive end of the floor. Today's episode of X's and O's is presented by Autograph. Sign up now with the promo code F68 for a chance to win $16 tickets to Purdue Senior Night on Sunday. Illinois has a top four offense in America, according to Ken Palm. According to Torvik, since January 30th, they've been the most efficient offense in the sport, and it's not really all that close. On Tuesday night, Illinois had their worst offensive performance in a month. The 31 points they scored in the second half was their lowest scoring half since a January 14th loss at Maryland. This had quite a bit to do with Edie, whose ability to switch ball screens out of Purdue's drop coverage took away so much of the Illinois isolation game. So much for booty ball. Marcus Damas couldn't get by him. Coleman Hawkins couldn't get by him. On this possession, his mere presence in the paint keeps Terrence Shannon from going at the smaller Braden Smith. Zach Eady finished with 28 points and won the Big Ten title with his defense. That's why he's the National Player of the Year. Again, follow for more X's and O's content just like this.